Survivor Series is a battle of brand supremacy as for one night of the year they compete against each other. As with every other sport where there is so much attention and pressure, wrestlers are sure to make mistakes. This is Wrestling Up and we're looking at the biggest botches from Survivor Series. Before we get into the rest of the video, make sure you subscribe to Wrestling Up and turn on all notifications to stay up to date with everything in the world of pro wrestling. Also, don't forget to follow us on Instagram at Wrestling Hub Official, and also follow us on Twitter at Wrestling underscore Hub. On the kickoff show, the panel said Adam Pearce had an announcement. Fans didn't know what to expect. However, Vince McMahon was seen arriving backstage. He stepped out of the car to the cheers of different wrestlers present, including Pierce. He didn't say a word, and then took out a golden egg from his car and held it in front of the wrestlers for them to cheer again. The crowd was perplexed, as they were not sure what they were seeing. Was it a reference to the years long back where a gobbledygooker emerged from a giant egg, a storyline that might have been Undertaker's origin if the bookers had not thought better? But no, it was a cross-promotion of The Rock's movie Red Notice. Unfortunately, with no mention of the film, fans had no idea what the egg was about, and they were left thinking Vince had finally lost his head. It only got worse as the night went on, with Vince saying it was worth $100 million. He showed the egg to Roman, who was bemused, as Pierce and Sonya Deville were asked to look for it. The segment was horrible, and it just seemed that Vince can't speak clearly anymore. Shinsuke Nakamura and Damian Priest are two of the best wrestlers on the roster. At the pay-per-view as the Intercontinental and US Champion met in the middle of the ring on the kickoff show, the match was one of the best of the night which showcased their capabilities. But there was one mistake in a blink and you miss it moment. Nakamura has made it part of his character to be athletic and take out anyone who comes in front of him. One of the moves he has specialized is the flying armbar, though it's a difficult move to execute, and that would be proved tonight. When Shinsuke flew to connect with it, he caught Priest. Where Priest was supposed to flip and land on his back, he instead landed on the back of his neck. It was not a serious botch and neither seemed hurt, but it was there. The two adjusted, leaving only the most attentive catching the small mistake, yet mainly admiring the man who turned even a botch into something that managed to look good. When Charlotte Flair and Becky Lynch met in the ring, it was immediately personal. Still, they delivered possibly the best match of the night as Becky walked away with a win. Flair went to hit her patented moonsault from the top rope to the outside, but missed completely, only hitting Becky with her arm after she had already fallen, with Becky forced to sell it. Riddle was facing the Usos in a tag team match when he made an obvious mistake. He was facing Jimmy in the ring and it was clear he was not all there for some reason. He lifted up Jimmy, and while it was an extraordinary move, what made it better was he was trying to see him punks go to sleep. Unfortunately, he would regret it, as he didn't connect and Jimmy just collapsed, making it awkward. In another small botch, Bianca took Natalia, put her against the corner, and hit her with shoulder tackles. Natalia was selling them, but she continued to do so even when Bianca stopped hitting it. This made it obvious with Bianca just jumping up and down. And these were the botches from Survivor Series. I hope you're all having a great day. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you later.